Hello everybody, I'm back with the Hot Wheels M case. As you can see, this is a C4982 case, which means it is a worldwide. If it's going to be a US case, it will be L592 something, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> but this is 957MMU. Out of the cases I've seen on YouTube, this is not one of the assortments that they've done. They've done an M assortment, but the other two letters is like, it'll be M, M, and then it will be something else. Like, there'll be A or W. I've seen a W and an A, I think. So, it's nice to see if there uh, is any variations in quantity, especially on these cases. So, I try to get one. I try to get a case, hopefully, I don't get to choose. Um, that is different from the ones online. So... Double check, make sure it looks like it's one thick row of tape instead of a retape, because it almost could be a retape. Look here. Looks like it is good. So. Sorry, it took me a second. I was looking at the tape, just trying to make sure that I didn't look at the tape before, which I normally do before I open the case. So, let's see what we have. First three out of the gate, um, we got the 71 Dodge Challenger, and I think this was in the last case, so that's pretty cool. It's a really nice car. We've got the rat mobile I really am liking this new rat mobile that they got going on it's white albino looks really cool 69 Camaro this is the regular um, Camaro in the last case the L case this was a super and I did pick one of those up at Walmart when they had the new L cases only the second time I think I found one in the wild another 69 Camaro convertible then we have the 70 Toyota Celica, uh, Celica, and this was a L case as well. Really nice work there. And the new recolor of the Surf's Up bus, which is a graffiti ride. Anyway, I like the bus, so that's cool. The bus to me is awesome. Looks like I got two of those, which is cool. The Porsche 918 Spider. I think this is new for this case. It may have came out the last case. But um, as you'll hear by many people that buy the, we buy these cases because they come out a little earlier. They don't have the new for 13, or they don't tell you. You can't figure out whether they came out of another case because whether they have maybe this case code or the other case code because this is an international car, so you don't get that. Um, here's another Surf's Up bus and the new Fast and Furious car. This is out of Fast and Furious 6, the newest one, and this is the Dodge. Uh, 69 Dodge Charger Daytona. It's an amazing, amazing piece of work. I'm really loving these Fast and Furious cars. Even the extra line they had at Walmart. So those are really coming out pretty cool. Um, next up we've got the new for this case, Chrysler 300 Hemi. This is also a graffiti ride. Not too fond of these weird looking tires, but eh, something you can get used to. We also have a Corvette Stingray in green. This was new for the L case. And also new for this case is the Snow Ride. It's looking pretty good. One that looks really awesome is this three window 34 Ford. Really liking this one. I think this is a new model for, it's not a new model, but it may be a because um, I think I've heard other people say that it's been out in the past, but it's the first time I've ever seen one because I've only been collecting for this year so far. I also have the Lotus Project M250. I think this was new recolor last case because this was a first to market, I believe, in Kmart K-Day. Um, and also new for this case is the MIG rig, which I'm really liking this one and going to be a fan. So I hope I get at least one more of those in this case. It's going to be one to collect. Keep awesome. Couple more. Uh, this one is Diesel Boy, and this was a recolor I think two cases ago. 
Um, I'm believing this is a new recolor for this case for the uh, 62 Chevy. I may be wrong. I see so many cars and I don't know where what case they are anymore since I see them worldwide cards. This was new last case, the custom 12 Ford Mustang. It might have been new the K case. I might be off because I got the K and the L at the same time. And now I've got a car avalanche over here because they're not sitting right. Okay. Next we have the 71 Plymouth Roadrunner. Nice casting. This is a recolor, I think, in the last case. Uh, the Baja Bone Shaker's been around for a couple cases in blue. And the 69 Corvette. And I'm pretty sure this is new for this case, especially in this color if it's not a new model. Really like it. It's awesome. Need one, need another one of those as well. It's coming up cool. Here is the custom 12 Ford Mustang. We just had another one of those. I believe this is from the K case. It might be from the L case. Not too sure on that. Um, we've got a new model as far as I'm concerned because I've never seen this. It kind of looks like the sting rod, but it's called the turbo turret. And then another one of the 69 Dodge Charger Daytonas from the Fast and Furious. Ooh, looks like we got another 69 Dodge Day Charger Daytona. So that's three of them so far. Pretty cool. We've got another turbo turret. And the new recolor, I think, of the Shark Cruiser for this case, which is an orange. Looking pretty nice. Okay, these are three repeats from last case, which is the Corvette Stingray. We've got the Volkswagen Beetle in red, which is a graffiti ride. And the stock car. I think that came out in the K case, actually. Next, we have a 57 Chevy, which was from the L case. It's a really nice casting. We also have the Volkswagen Scirocco GT24. And I think this is from several cases ago. It was also an L case Zamac for Walmart exclusive. And here is another Batmobile. I've been picking these up because these are awesome. And as I've heard before, this is the Keaton Batmobile. I haven't been paying attention to really all the Batmobiles and all the movies, so that's just what others say. So we'll go with it. Looks like we're going to get a third, another second Batmobile, excuse me, along with a second 70 Toyota Celica. Got another Batmobile and a 08 Dodge Challenger SRT8. And I think that is new for this case. It may have came out last case because it's part of the Now and Then series. So that's the first half of this lovely box. Let's look at the second half. And I see some, I see a combi. Really looking for that combi. Combi ambi. First three out is the Surf Crate. New recolor. Then we got two of the uh, 69 Dodge Chargers. Nice car. Hold this up. And we got the uh, 71 Dodge Challenger, which we already had one of those in this case. This is new for the last case, was the 08 Ford Focus. And then the 62 Chevy. It's number two for this case as well. Uh, let's see. We've got a Honda S2000 in red. We got the new 2010 Ford Shelby GT500 Super Snake in white. Really like that car. And then, of course, an awesome Dragon Blaster. Let's see if I can hold this. We got another um, 08 Ford Focus. Another casting I'll be picking up a lot is this Bump Around in Blue. They recently released that in red a couple cases ago. So now I think they're trying to do that idea I was thinking of of recently releasing a whole bunch of different bumper cars and then maybe having a play set that you could have a, you know, possible. And then this is the Max Steel Motorcycle with clear wheels, which was in the last case. Here's another Honda S2000. 
another Diesel Boy, and another Shark Cruiser Orange. Okay, we've got a Ratified, another Surf, cr surf Crate, and an Acura NSX, and I think this is a new recolor, because it's in purple, it's looking really good in purple. Okay, we've got a 70 Plymouth Barracuda from, I think it was the last case, or it may have been the K case. This one's been hanging around way too long, the 66 Chevy Nova, and then the awesome Volkswagen Cool Combi. Really liking that model. In all three color variations it's been. No freaking way. Okay. You'll find out in a second why. Volkswagen Beetle from the last case. And if you can see the card, you'll notice the car. I just saw it with the, head, the hood flopped up. It is the Super 67 Camaro. You can see the rubber tires, the TH on the back. Wow. I did not expect to get this. I love Camaros, and I'm so happy to get this Super. So awesome. Looks like it has a little bit of a paint error on the top, too. So it's a best of both worlds. It's an air and a super. Man, this is awesome. You guys got to be looking out for this for the M case. Keep an eye out for it. It's an awesome super. We got the 70 Plymouth uh, Barracuda with the top down there. Man, I lost focus now that I found the super. Whew. So here's the treasure hunt coming up next. Here's the recolor for the speed box. It's in yellow. I like the white much better. Then we have the fire eater, which is the treasure hunt for this case, in white with flames. I did uh, buy one for, I think it was the 2010 treasure hunt, so they've been making this, trying to get the stand there, making this for the treasure hunt for a couple years. And then the so fine, which was a new car in the last case. few more cars to go. Got the Lotus, the Project M250. We've got another Dragon Blaster and another 70, well this is the first one in this one. This is a 71 Mustang Boss 351 and this is part of the then and now with the Ford Mustang. So it's a really nice one. Six left. Got another 10 Ford Shelby GT500 Super Snake in white. We got a Porsche uh, 918 Spider and the another MIG rig. So I'm happy to get two of those because I'm really looking forward to those. Okay. This case is full of excitement. Got another Acura NSX. A new model, the, at least as far as I'm concerned, the Chicane. And the 71 Plymouth Roadrunner. So that's another one. So this case was super and treasurific. So keep an eye out for the next case. I think it's the end case. It'll be coming out here um, probably at the end of June. So keep an eye out for that and several other uh, awesome videos to come. Thanks for watching. And please like, comment, and subscribe.